If you turn that light on, if you turn that light on, I will leave. I promise you. Shot of the city, out of the city. We are in, I keep saying Lewisburg, but Louisville? Louisville. Louisville, Louisville Indiana at the Geyer Opera House. And lots of haunted stories and evidence of activity is the word that Bob from Indie Ghost Centers likes to use. And this is Jeff from Paranormal Indy. We're going to go on a tour of this place. And Bob even brought a crew. I brought a crew as well. And uh, we'll see what happens tonight. Sounds good. It'll be fun. This is where a lot of the stuff has happened upstairs, right, guys? A lot of the EVPs we heard were recorded upstairs. Yes. So there are still shows that happen in here. Absolutely, correct, yeah. This door over here is the uh, way you get to the uh, light booth that's up there. You have to go up a ladder. It's kind of cool up there. Um, I've been up there and I've heard growling. Angie, do you want to go up? Where's Angie? We've lost Angie. <laughs> Angie? <laughs> Angie? I'm not even kidding you. Where's Angie? No, she was just with us. Angie, are you messing with us? Where were you? I'm not saying. What? I was hiding. <laughs> you were hiding? Yes. Are you just trying to amp this up a little bit? Yeah. Okay, thanks. What, is, what has happened in this chair? It's just moved on its own? That's what some groups have said. I've not experienced that. In the third row, the third aisle, one, two, yeah right uh, in front of you, Sean, a lot of people have reported seeing a little shadow figure running back and forth through there. The one thing that you have to realize about spirits is we don't know what they're trying to say or in that dimension how it sounds. So it could be a person trying to communicate, but what we're hearing... It comes out we, as growling. We, exactly. Okay. Don't assume the worst. I said there may be growling of a different nature when I get up there. Does that mean, does that mean you have gas from dinner? Yes, it was bad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it was really bad. Okay. So these are the dressing rooms? Yes, you said that you were... You had a strange feeling back here. Do you mean that like right presently or just from your experience and being no, back here before? Just my experience just over the years. I just kind of came down through here and kind of, you know, the hair kind of the stands on your up back. back of your neck. Yep. That's when you kind of think, okay, this might be a good idea, good place to set some stuff up. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, is there people downstairs? Did you hear something? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I heard that too. No, seriously, I did hear that. Are there people coming? Are people coming? No, there has to be. Video intern Adam thinks that Adam thinks that he heard something. He said, "Are there more people coming?" We said, "No." What are you guys hearing? It just sounded like people were downstairs. Yeah, like and footsteps. Like trying to get someone, no, like saying, "Like hey." It was you know, a bunch of women's voices. A couple, like a couple people joining late. What is this? This is a building adjacent to the Geyer House. I believe at one time it was a morgue. Wonderful. Let's go in. <laughs> Fantastic. Either a morgue, funeral home. Same thing, whatever. Something with dead folks. All right. Right here, sitting on this couch, is where we got that EVP about the little girl, mom, uh, mommy, a flashlight. Mm -hmm. We got that right here in this room. Mm -hmm. um, I've been touched in this, this room and downstairs. And it's just... Uh, Spookier for me here than the other rooms. Okay, and downstairs may have stored bodies at one point as well. Correct. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. So we just wrapped up our tour of the Geyer Opera House. Anything here tonight convincing you that it's haunted? Actually, me and Jill and, and that guy right there heard some women's voices. That we can't explain? No, it was I like a, a flutter of voices. I wish that I had heard that, but you guys hearing that? And they were women whispering. Like several of them. There's nothing more terrifying than that. Didn't we? So, you 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 experiencing we, we that is convincing enough. We weren't sure if it was an echo me. or what it might have been, but we well, did, there were we not. There were no other women whispering, so we did hear it yeah. distinctly. Okay, 
I, I would say I'm not necessarily convinced by anything that I experienced tonight, but your experience of that is convincing to me, and certainly the EVPs and video evidence and other things we've seen we're from still going in the other dark. people's experiences. And now we're going to do an investigation in the dark. Yeah, total dark. Which I'll have to, I guess, write about underneath the video because you won't be able to see that, obviously. Right. Yeah. Are you going to sleep good tonight? Sure. Can I sleep with you? No. <laughs>